prepare to step into a world where the line between reality and the supernatural blurs, where fear lurks in every shadow. The night seems to hold its breath, waiting for the wailing woman's lament to pierce the silence. You know, folks around these parts have been telling La Llorona tales for generations, but lately, it feels like those old stories have been waking up. I've seen the shivers in people's eyes when they talk about it, like they've glimpsed something they can't explain. Makes me wonder if there's more to these legends than we think. Les histoires oubliées, elles nous appellent du passé, cherchant une voix pour les réveiller. Forgotten stories, they call to us from the past, seeking a voice to awaken them. A cry from the depths of despair, a chilling reminder of a past that refuses to stay buried. Night after night, the wailing of La Llorona echoes in my dreams, a haunting melody that I can't escape. They say the old cemetery is the closest thing to her domain, a place where she roams when the moon's high and the night's at its darkest. Le vent murmure des secrets anciens et la pluie raconte des tragédies jamais oubliées. The wind whispers anciens secrets and the rain recounts tragedies never forgotten. In the dark embrace of sleep, La Llorona's sorrow becomes my own, a relentless tide of anguish. I've been delivering mail in these parts for years, and I've heard my fair share of eerie tales. But this one, about La Llorona, it's got a grip on this town like it's been waiting for something. Zaria Hollow proudly presents La Femme Qui Pleure, The Wailing Woman. Brace yourself for an unforgettable descent into the macabre.